tired. I can't drive any further. Okay. It might be too long. And then, um, what happened? Um, what happened? Oh. They say, well, I shouldn't sleep there because sometimes people break the back windows out and steal people's purses. I'm like, well, damn, do I look like a bitch? Do I, got, I ain't got no purse? You know? And then they come in the mood. I'm like, all right, fine, they left. Went to the regular parking lot, paid some money, like a dollar an hour place to sleep. I'm always sleeping on my car. Man, this car is so comfortable to sleep in. I mean, sometimes I'm on my way home from Osaka. So I have to work the next day, but I don't have to work till like 10. So I'll just drive, and as soon as I can sleep, I just pull over into Lawson's convenience stores. Because now the convenience stores, they're, I'll show you, the parking lots are real big, and they make them so people can um, um, go there and sleep in the cars and stuff, or sleep in these trucks and stuff, these um, transport trucks and stuff. And uh, it's really, 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 really nice. So I'll just sleep. Wake up the next morning. Where am I thinking I'm at home? I ain't at home. Oh my god, I gotta go to work. Start the car. Punch it. Boom. Go home, take a shower, and go to work. Work from 10 to 11 or 10 to 10 45, and after that, have like a three, four hour break. Go home, sleep again, or go to Starbucks. But right next to my school, there's a college. Man, there's a whole bunch of girls up in there. Every time I drive home, drive out there, I was walking up and down the um, hill and stuff and down the streets. But I don't talk to them. I don't know. I should, but I don't. It's too close. Anyway, this is the traffic jam. On the other side, they're driving real fast, going about their business. They're happy. And I only have 55 kilometers worth of gas. Seven kilometers. So I've been talking all this time. And we only went 2.2 kilometers in 10 minutes. Oh my goodness! Well, in 12 minutes and 39 seconds. But it's cool out here. Oh man! I just noticed some. This is on repeat. And they go to police. Oh, they're not the police. They go to construct. Ah. Oh. And he got the uh, emergency um, vehicles out here. They are rolling in uh, those land cruisers and stuff. So, I don't know what's wrong, but it seems like it might be a accident or something. Uh, they got undercover car. Wow. Kawhi. Usually, the undercover cars, then there's crowns. And there's crown. Uh, what are they called? You see that truck, that bike right behind them? They're in those uh, athlete crowns. Crown athlete by Toyotas and stuff. They don't, um, they're like a GS, but uh, the lower version, regular Toyota version. But they're popular. Those cars, man, they be <sighs> driving next to them and the police be dressed in the blue so you don't know. And there's another way you can know how to identify it, but I'm not going to say that. Rolling though, and sometimes man, people don't be paying attention because it's easy to spot them, you know. And it's real easy to spot them and pull up. And people be rolling BMWs and stuff, <sighs> Lexuses, <sighs> sports cars <sighs> right behind them. And all of a sudden, that red light come popping out the car. One of them cops pull over in the right lane, Woo! hit that gas. <sighs> Pull over, thousand dollar ticket, eight hundred dollar ticket, six hundred dollar ticket. You gotta pay within a month. If you don't, they'll come after you. Well, they don't come after you, but eventually they do. And then on the parking tickets, if you park, sometimes they'll put these little yellow tags, or they used to put these yellow yellow tags around your uh, the um, you know, that mirror, whatever it's called. And, um, 
so people be driving around with it for like months because they can't afford the ticket because the tickets are like $150. And you're supposed to pay it like as soon as you get in. Or it's like out here, you know, they just tag uh, the owner. So if you get a ticket, you know, uh, it don't it doesn't affect your insurance. It just affects your uh, car. So that's good. In America, you get a ticket. You gotta pay extra money for your. Uh, um, huh? You don't pay extra money. Yeah, yeah. You get points taken off it or added to your insurance. Stuff out here, they don't do that. But one day I was driving down the street and a rock hit my windshield. <laughs> Had to change it. Yeah. My insurance went up because I used it only up $11, so I was happy because it wasn't an accident. Let me change this. I want to listen to some. Uh, what's his name? Uh, too short, but uh, I don't want to listen to him right now. I want to listen to. Uh, what's his name? Snoop Dogg. stopped on a freeway we are stopped and all that talking I was still we only went 800 meters oh my god 800 meters that was it and I got still there but here uh, can you focus, can I focus in on that oh man uh, okay I'm gonna go this way uh, this way go down here Go to Umeda. Get off here at Umeda, I think. Well, man, what happened? Go down to Umeda. Go to Umeda. Get off. Yeah. Alright, get off at Homachi. Well, Umeda's easier to get off. Not easier, but it's sooner. Get the hell off this freeway. But as you can see, to get to Umeda, I still got a long, long, long drive. Right now we're in Kyoto. Well, no, no. We're supposed to be in Osaka. Super. This is Amagasaki. That's supposed to be Kyoto. This is Nishimura. Nishinomiya. This is, no, no. Nishinomiya, Nishinomiya. So I still have 28, 29 kilometers just to go somewhere. My English is messed up and I only got 53 kilometers worth of gas. So, wouldn't it be a shame if I got, oh, it's raining now. I got stuck in, on the freeway because I ran out of gas. Terrible, huh? Press on board. Would you please see me making this video? They're gonna stop me, or are you talking on the phone? I'm not talking on the phone, I'm shooting a video. Anyway, this is the cars they be rolling in. Oh man, I'm 